What's good? What's good? Welcome back to Invest in Trade with Jax. We're gonna go over V Chain guys. Vet currently we're up about four percent on the day. Nice little push. 0 0.09 or sitting on market cap of 5.77 billion. 24 hour volume, 358 million. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to crypto.com, sign up to the world's fastest crypto growing app. And you can grab one of the incredible Visa cards for cash back and crypto, free Spotify, Netflix, Prime, travel incentives. Depending on the level of card that you have, $25 just for signing up through my referral. All right, guys. So we're here on the one hour time frame. So, so our first buy zone was at 0.083. Um, I had dropped this one in earlier, but that was after we had already bounced here. So we just had that first buy zone hit. So that's a nice little trade up to this take profit zone of 8%, nice little trade. Um, good time to take some profits, close 50%, 25%, not financial advice. Of course, use your own discretion. But as you can see here, we do have a bearish divergence on the on the one hour RSI as well as on the one hour money flow, which does usually signify that you're going to see a move back down. Price is moving up, money is flowing out. Um, so price can't just continue to push up, but sometimes they can be invalidated. Money will push up, the money flow, the RSI will push up. Uh, sometimes they are invalidated. They're, they're accurate about 75, 80% of the time. And then that other 20, 25%. It can be invalidated, all right, guys. So we've come all the way up to 0.090. If I pop over to the four hour time frame, so we broke out of this massive falling wedge pattern. We're kind of just trading sideways right now as we wait for Bitcoin to really make its decision. We do have a bit of a double bottom here. We came up bottom, second bottom. So, like, let me drop in a neckline for this little pattern here. And you can see we came back, we back tested. Uh, the neckline as support, we held the four hour EMAs. We're just having the bullish cross. So if it continues to push up here, yeah, we've already almost make, met our target. Your target's up at about 0 0.092 for V chain. You can see we're trending towards overbought on the four hour as well. You can see on the money flow as well. So I'm just gonna quickly close this. So if we do continue to push up guys, our next tick profit zone is 0 0.098. Um, for V chain, and then if we do roll over, I would keep this buy zone here at about 0 0.0839. If you're looking at dollar cost average, 0 0.076, 0 0.069, 0 0.05, 0 0.035. Equal amounts at each buy zone. Drop your average price halfway each time. If you're leverage trading, you have to double your margin. All right, guys. So let's look at VET on the daily time frame. So there are some bullish signs here, especially if we get back above the 20 EMA on the daily, but if I take my Fibonacci, swing low, swing high, inverted, you can see here we came right down to the 0.786, we bounce. So if we could get back above the golden ratio here, if we don't get rejected, that would be a really bullish sign uh, for V chain. And if we get back above the 20, that's a strong sign of continuation, get back above the 55, just as we did here, we broke below the EMAs, we bounced, we got back above the 20, back above the 55, and we saw a nice pump back to the upside for VeChain. Of course, Bitcoin keeps controls the market, so keep a close eye. And let's see if we see it. We're seeing a nice little push right now. So let's see if we push up from this double bottom. We back to as support if we bounce up to about 50K. Or if we come up, we hit resistance, we create a double top and we roll over. All right, guys. But as of right now, nice little trade for our friend VeChain of about 8%. I will give you your bull run targets based off our Fibonacci here. For VET, we have the 1.618, which is coming in at about 0 0.075, the two extension, which I think VET will make it to on this bull run at about $1.40. And you have the 2.272 coming in at 217. And this Fibonacci is pulled from our April swing high down to our crash low. So from the current price, I mean, incredible time as an investor to load the bags, in my opinion. Uh, that's about, wow guys, a 14X, 15X, basically a 15X gain all the way up to the two extension for VeChain. So VeChain came all the way back down to the summer lows, very close to our summer lows for VeChain. Let's see here if we use some Elliott wave theory, wave one, corrective wave two, impulsive wave three, your largest wave, corrective wave four, all the way down here, impulsive wave five, bull run target, $1.40, all right guys? So I would I would target those levels in between seventy five and a dollar forty for V chain. If we if this is our true bottom, we can give our target for our next impulsive wave, previous swing high, swing low, 
target the 1.618, which is coming in at about 33 cents for a bet. Uh, you can see we came to oversold here on the one on the daily RSI, and we're seeing a nice bounce. We were oversold right here, nice bounce to the upside, oversold, big bounce to the upside. So we're just starting to see our bounce back to the upside for VeChain. Let's look at the MACD. Let's see if we're having the bullish cross on the MACD. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? <laughs> Sorry guys, wrong indicator. MACD, please. Yes, all right. Yeah, so we're just having the bullish cross of the MACD. You can see here the blue line. Let me thicken this up for you guys. Hope you're well, guys. Hope the pets are healthy and hope you're working towards all your goals and aspirations and crypto is helping you get there just as it is helping me. <laughs> see, we're just having the bullish cross, the blue line over the MACD, over the orange line. And the last time we had the bullish cross, juicy pump. We had the bullish cross right here, juicy pump as well, guys. So we're just printing the bullish cross of the MACD on the daily. So not financial advice, but I would definitely be loading the bags or looking to load the bags. Mostly I trade, but from an investing standpoint, from, but from an investing standpoint, incredible time to load the bags for VeChain. So that's basically it for this one, guys. Uh, quick shout out to the Discord, over 1,000 members posting chart patterns, talking all things crypto, as well as the DCA charts for your viewing at any time here. We have Decentraland, we have Sandbox, we have Matic, we have Vet, we have Gala, we have Phantom. We have a bunch of coins in here for our dog house average strategy. Price for coffee, sign up through the Patreon, check out Bybit, check out crypto.com. You can follow me on IG, and I'll see you in the next one. Much love. Take care.